Today we leave Canary Islands on a seven day passage to Cabo Verde. If you want to see what it's really like crossing the Atlantic Ocean with a dog, don't forget to hit that subscribe button to follow along our journey. Sorry about the camera, it's four o'clock in the morning and it's pretty dark. So I'm on watch, I have been for a while. Just been watching Sex in the City on Netflix. I almost gone through the whole first season and it's only day one, so I'm in a bit of trouble. Anyways, so super light conditions. We're motoring as you can hear. I'm pretty chill, it's beautiful. It is so damp outside. Having these cockpit enclosures is obviously amazing just in general for the security and how comfortable it is but also there's no moisture coming in from the air outside. I'm out here with blankets and my pillow and stuff and it's all dry. I've been in contact with quite a few of our friends and family on our Iridium Go. There's a boat that we actually are in a, an Instagram group with who are all heading to Cape Verde and then across the Atlantic. And we're in contact with them at the moment because they're out here somewhere with us. They sent us their Latin long, but I haven't, I haven't charted it, but they said they're not that far away from us, which is cool. And yeah, just been entertaining myself, chatting with friends and family, watching Netflix. I ate some chocolate. Jackson and Ryan are downstairs having a nap in bed. All right, guys, I'm gonna get back to my show. All right, guys, it's about 6.30 in the morning. It's time to go wake Ryan up. Just come in and like wake up and scare me by putting your face in my face. Hey, baby. Stay here and stay with mom. We need to come up with the boys. <sighs> Day two, guys. Brady went to bed earlier. It was pitch black, so I couldn't film. So we're waiting for the sun to come up. But it's been pleasant. Unfortunately, we've been murdering though. Which we knew. The wind's slowly, slowly picking up, I can see, but not enough to sail. So the quicker we get south, the quicker we get the sails up. We're just going to keep motoring down. We've got some big swell coming up in the next probably 24 hours. I think it's going to be about 3.6, 3.7 meter swell right on the side. So if we head south quickly, we can catch the wind. So when the big swell comes, we've got a bit of wind to kind of help support us a bit. We've got our radar on, the radar is showing like nothing in front of us. We've been alone pretty much the whole night. We've got about a dozen tanker ships, 30 nautical miles out to our left here. Nothing out to our right, except for the Caribbean, about three weeks away. <laughs> been kicking back, Jackson's been... Uh... Jackson, how you going buddy? Man, he's tired, he's been like <laughs> hanging out, running back and forth. He's, uh... he's pooped, poor thing. Always takes a couple of days to get into the swing of everything. So always feel a bit lethargic. Lethargic. So, epic. Day one of sailing, motoring.
Where are they, Jackson? You scared them, buddy. You scared the dolphins away again. Hey, did you have fun with the dolphins, Jackson? Hey, that buddy, was, come on. That was his morning run. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ryan's up front sun tanning, and I'm about to make some lunch. I've really been looking forward to this because we've had like no gas for like a couple of weeks. Now we finally got gas, we're actually eating like good again. Come on, mate. Yeah, raise yours up. All right, so we've got the pole out, we've got the sail out. How fast are we going? It's we're motoring at like seven and a half knots and uh, now we're going about four and a half, five. Wind's gonna, apparently pick up from here on out so hopefully we'll start building speed again the swirl is going to pick up to about three and a half meters right now i'd say it's about two meters but it's about 10 seconds apart by tomorrow it'll be three and a half meters 14 seconds apart yeah well, we get a few big ones that's when the sail flaps a bit so we've got about 12 30 knots of wind so oh yeah so this is it this will be us for the night jackson will have another pee break up front hey buddy Should we go up front again don't you just me sleeping just woke him up he's popped his head up to look at me <laughs> Brittany's on a Ridium go who are you talking to Brittany? a catamaran that messaged us right before we left and they're a day behind us uh, we've got a catamaran beside us we've got one behind us and then there's us at least we know we've got other people who made the same decision as us Brittany whether it's right or wrong hey <laughs> Well, good morning, everyone. As you can hear, we're motoring. The wind just cannot hold our sails. It eventually just got intolerable. Can't be good on our rigging. 9 a.m. on day three. Ryan and Jackson are down in bed having a snooze. You feeling me? Alright, I got le potato with a bit of the carrot, du cauliflower, du sauce. That's what I got for lunch. What the hell did you do with bread? I don't know, I know where to put it, so I put it around the bowl. Oh, we got wind now. We need to turn this motor off. Gentle. Oh, good boy. All right, sexy legs. So, Christmas Eve, so the wind should be picking up around about now. So we should have some steady wind for the rest of the trip now, finally. That's on all weather models. It said this morning we hit that 3.5 meter wave that was like, 14 seconds apart. Now it says it's two and a half meters, 11 seconds apart. So it's probably about two and a half meters. I'd say it's not 11 seconds, but. All right, this is for the whole trip now. Now, chances of rain. We have no rain this trip. There's no clouds on this trip. Christmas is gonna be sunny. Am I uh, gonna be able to go downstairs and cook eggs Benedict for breakfast? Of course you are. <laughs> 
Oh, you could do it in five meters slow, couldn't you? No, I couldn't. <laughs> My poached eggs would end up scrambled. Yeah, no, nah, we're all good. It's going to be like this the whole trip now. And I'm like, oh, so what's for dinner, sweet cheeks? Like, okay. eh, like expecting something epic. And she came up, she goes like, oh, I'm not hungry. You, like, you? <laughs> <laughs> you can have some noodles. <laughs> well, the sunset. It's really nice sailing at the moment. The only thing is, is the swell's kind of confused again. It's like rock solo when you go to sleep. Then when I go to sleep, they're like rocking left and right. No, guys, do you know what the difference is? I can literally sleep in anywhere, anything, anytime. Ryan's like the princess in the pea. Everything just has to be just right for you to go to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> Jensen, you and I'm gonna roll off the couch. Good morning guys. It's the morning of day four. Good pee, buddy. Nice. Merry Christmas! <laughs> We're right dead smack bang in the middle of the Canary Islands and Cape Verde. Off the coast of Africa. What a place to be for Christmas. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! <laughs> Brittany's awake now. What's the time? It's 9 a.m. Uh, 9 a.m. We just woke up and uh, opened up a Christmas present. Bro Brittany bought me a Mars bar. I bought you Santa boxers. We had some big plans for Christmas. We're like. <laughs> We're gonna have dinner, we're gonna have wicked breakfast, we're gonna do this, we're gonna do that. I thought like, this is gonna be really cool, we'll go sit at the bow and sunbake. And we both sat here, and for the first time ever, I've actually felt sick. Brittany's not feeling well. It has been a complete wash machine here. Oh, it's settled down now, but yeah, look. Looks like nothing to worry about. Look at that, flat, calm seas. I don't even get seasick, and I almost got seasick today. Anyway, I think we're gonna write Christmas off, hey? Ryan is little Christmas Sundays washing Jackson's pee down. Jackson's very proud of himself. Good boy, buddy! <laughs> <laughs> That's a good boy! I think what we should do is put the motor on, pull a bit of mainsail out, just to give some stability while I'm up there, to like play around with that sail. What do you think? Yeah. I think you need to slow down. I've just got it on revs, so I've got to down the revs. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Stop Doesn't sound right. You're not letting it out enough. Oh shit. Okay. Hold on. This, this is all twisted. Oh. It's backwinding. There we go. Can okay, go now? Can you release the topping lift? Just had to unclip myself. Good morning. Jackson. We're rocky and rolling everywhere. The guys a day behind us said they've got two meter swell seven seconds apart. Hello. We've turned the motor on. Although our sail is still out just to charge the batteries up a little bit. Yeah, we've been sailing really well the last few days, but it's just taken a toll on our batteries. Our sail keeps stealing the sun. I've just done my post on our Iridium Go, so like every day we've just been doing like an update of how the passage is and blah, 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 blah. Yeah. So yeah, that's an update from us. This is the evening of day five. 
Doing good, P? Good boy. Go on. Go, P, buddy. And straight to his bowl of water. There's what's left of the sunset. Bye, son. We'll see you tomorrow, buddy. Come on, mister. Day five done and dusted. We've laid around, we've played with Jackson, he's had his brekkie, he's done his peas and poos on the bow, he's barked with his dolphins, we've had dinner. Now it's just time for some sunset love. Brown chicka brown wow. Just in time for sunset. We made it. Seven days. Nailed it. <laughs> super excited, but I'm super tired, hey Brittany? Yeah. But here we are. <laughs> Cheers, my love. Cheers, guys. I gotta hold my box with Brittany and my nuts are gonna get tanned. Lovely. <laughs> it's probably the most uncomfortable we've been so far, eh? Uncomfortable. -less. It's a word, all right. Look it up in the Ryan dictionary. Beautiful sunset shot, oh, tainted by the dog taking a crap. <laughs> Jackson, come here! <laughs> and Ryan's just brought me up some chopped up oranges. Yeah. Got some? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Mine just sat down. It's like you didn't notice my fault. Oh, there's nothing to see here. It's Turns all natural. You're an it's idiot. all natural. Jackson, mate, come here, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what are you, Jackson? Hey, mate. Oh, no, isn't that cool? Jackson, look, look. 